What up guys, welcome back to a new video and today we're going to talk about the top 10 penny stocks you need to be watching in 2018 February. Those stocks are bound to spike or bound to go down in value. There's one way and we know the exact date this will happen because I'm going to give it to you. Now why do I say that? Because we only trade pharmaceutical penny stocks like I said. So if you're new to this make sure you look at the rest of the videos and how to trade those penny stocks and how to make the decision. But if you're new I'm going to just explain it to you in this video real quick um, and I'm going to go through the stocks um, and give you the dates to watch out for them. So we only trade pharmaceutical penny stocks because we can predict the exact date they will spike in value or go down in value. Those penny stocks don't have revenue, those penny stocks don't have a product. So in order to get a product, in order to start getting revenue, they have to test the product, the drug, to see if it actually works for that specific disease that they're testing the product. Um, so they have to do basically FDA approvals and they have to test the drug. So there's two catalysts. Um, the result of that drug or the result of the FDA approval will basically attract investors to that stock because now they think that this stock is going to have a product because they're ready. All they have to do is get funding to actually start producing that product. So once you have this, that is your decision now. You have to buy it or sell it. If the stock comes out with a positive trial, then the, the stock is going to shoot up on value. If the stock comes out with a negative trial, then the stock is going to go down on value. So now you can either buy it or short it. Shorten is the best thing for me because I can't go wrong with shorten. Once they come out with negative, I short the stock and that's it. Okay, because it's a penny stock. You know, they failed the whole purpose of, of the company if, if they failed the actual trial. So make sure, guys, you analyze it and learn how to analyze it. Watch the rest of my videos in this playlist. Let's talk penny stocks uh, playlist. I have 10 penny stocks in this paper written after doing some research for you guys that I'm going to explain to you. Um, so have a listen. If you're watching this in 2018, if you're watching this in 2019, 20, or May, February, um, whatever month, you'll still need this video. So have a look at the description for that link because that link you can tr keep track of those stocks whichever day, whichever month of the year. However, for February 2018, here are the 10 top stocks that could spike or go down on value. First stock, AVEO, February 8th or February 10th. Between those days, so keep an eye on the website of that company. The ticker is AVEO. And I'll have all the stocks in the description, so have a look in the description, guys, for those stocks. Um, so... I'm not going to go into details because these stocks don't have revenue. Everything, we don't look at financials. That's all we care about is the trial. It's the product that they're going to develop. These companies don't have products. So all I'm going to go through is the ticker and the date because that is the catalyst. Okay. Fold, F-O-L-D, February 8th, 2018. C-B-I-O, February 9th. Woo! All right, guys, I just sneezed. I took a sneeze break. You can see. Uh, next one is J-N-G, February 9th. T-Con, T-C-O-N. February 10th, yeah, you can see my eyes. VRX, February 13th, guys. ATRS, February 14th. KURA, February 15th, 17th. APRI, February 17th. IMMP, February 17th. Guys, if I miss any stock here, make sure you look at the description because I only picked 10 because I wanted to keep the video as 10 and that's it. But the in the description, I'm going to give you a link. So have a look at the link and search for the rest of the stocks if you're late to this. And like I said, if you're coming in May, January, uh, June... Uh, 2018 or 19 guys you'll still need this video because the link I have will give you the dates down the line so keep it on the link that's how you track those stocks and to find the results of the trial you need to go on the website and remember guys the company's website okay because the result will be released on the company's website and the FDA website as well so guys remember if a stock releases a positive result you buy the stock on the day market open because it's going to spike. And if you have pre-market trading, that's very good for you. Because you can buy it pre-market and sell it once once the, basically the market opens. Because on the day, it will pull back eventually, guys. Just remember that. If a stock comes out with a negative trial, the stock is going to slump. So you make sure you short that stock and you don't buy that stock. If they come out with a mixed result, okay? And a mixed result is a result where they basically say... This, this basically drug failed, but this drug passed. Then you stay on the sideline. You don't trade. Make sure you don't trade because you don't know which way it's going. Okay? So that's it, guys. That's all for me. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you leave the like, the comment, the subscription. And let me know in the comment section if you want more videos like these. But make sure you watch the rest of the videos, guys.